The break in the rain didn't last long. We're tracking more showers tonight with the help of our first alert radar network. Although this system will be far less significant than the last one, we're keeping an eye on a number of problem areas such as this one. This is the one in Beverly Glen. News Chopper 4 flew over the damage this afternoon. And our Alex Rozier joins us live from one of the neighborhoods also hit hard by mudslides. Alex. Colleen, amazingly, no one was hurt here, but several families were evacuated and several homes were damaged, including this one. Look back there. That's the foundation here, and the home slid off the foundation and down the hill. That's really just the beginning of the problems here on Caribou Lane. It was early Monday morning when the slide started, and neighbor Travis Longcore told us what happened. So big rumble, boom, knocks it off its foundation runs in across the street, hits this house. As you can see, it's knocked the, the support off of it. Six people in three different homes were evacuated. Thankfully, no one was hurt, but several structures were red tagged, including this carport that crashed onto this SUV. Everyone was kind of shocked by the whole thing. Dinah Danovich lives at the bottom of the hill, and she welcomed neighbors to her home in the middle of the night Monday as the slide took off. I think we had 15 or 20 people come over at 3 a.m., and we made the best of it. Afterward, there was quite the discovery when people found a baby grand piano that was damaged. Neighbors say the piano was built into the home that fell off its foundation, and it was once owned by an opera singer in the 40s. It was ejected from the house as it hit this other house and landed on this carport and then bounced, if you can imagine a baby grand piano bouncing, down into the road over here. After a difficult start to the week, the sun returned, but many here are still concerned that their problems aren't over. There's just a sense of caution, uh, I think, that we all have right now to, until we really understand the, the dynamics of that slide. And as we bring you back out live here, you're looking at some of the heroes of the week. And those are the hardworking L.A. DWP workers trying to get power back on in the neighborhood. They tell me in the next hour or two, they think they'll get power back on for most of the areas surrounding Beverly Glen and the Caribou Lane here specifically, except for a few of the homes that are right here. But we're going to continue to follow this story, a difficult week here in Beverly Glen. You're reporting live, I'm Alex Rozier, NBC4 News.